Good afternoon and welcome back. This is Forrest with New Media Marketing Pros here in Chesterfield, Missouri. Just wanted to go through really quick and show you how to connect your Twitter account with your Facebook fan page account. Again, uh, we're going to go through and show you the settings. So, you, of course, you have to have a Twitter account set up. We set this up just about a month ago on Twitter. Of course, it's Geek Quotient. Feel free to follow us here if you're into geeky stuff and you want to tweet about geeky stuff. Look us up. It's Geek Quotient. Dot com or geekquotient.com is at geekquotient. Click on the settings tab, of course. From the settings tab, you're going to go into your profile tab. Under your profile tab, you want to click on add Twitter to your site. There's a little link there. Click on the Facebook tab. Click on the Facebook application link. Install Twitter and Facebook. Now, if you currently have a Facebook account linked up or a Twitter account linked up to Facebook this page will be a little bit different there will be a, an account up here that says disconnect or disallow or something that's going to dis something it'll turn it off so click that then it should bring you back to this page when you see this down here it says sign out if you want to connect to an account other than the current account so if you wanted to connect to a different Twitter account then you'd have to sign out and log in with that one click allow then on the next page, it's going to ask you what you want to connect to. You can connect to your Facebook profile or you can connect to your Facebook fan page. And you can see we've got a couple of fan pages here. I'm going to connect Geek Quotient to Geek Quotient in this fashion so it'll run. It's linked up. And again, if I want to share this information, share this link, I can tell people what I'm doing. It'll just, just like you normally share into. Um, into Facebook it'll do that basically it's all done it says your Facebook and Twitter accounts are now connected I did this earlier but you can match your Facebook profile page up with your Twitter profile picture if you want to you don't have to sometimes they can be different whatever but that should work and typically it's going to take you a few minutes for all this stuff to propagate through so what we need to do is we're going to go back to our Facebook homepage again here is Geek Quotient this is the Geek Quotient fan page here and we're gonna send a tweet from Twitter to see if it all works so we'll go back to Twitter we'll go to our home page here and of course we're gonna type in a tweet and if you have an iPhone or PDA or whatever let's see how to install a I can type right. And of course, I want to put a URL over here. So if I was going to do a video, I put the video. But this is just a test, and we'll just write "test" in there, and we'll hit tweet. And if everything is working the way it's supposed to be working, what I just typed here should show up on my Facebook fan page. So let's go see. Let's do a refresh. Keep our fingers crossed. And there it is, how to install a Twitter feed into a Facebook fan page test. So there it is. And of course you can do this from, if you have a tweet deck or something on your smartphone, you can use it that way and send a link over that way. But again, I put the feed right here. So that's the steps that you use to set it into your fan page. I hope you enjoyed and we'll see you again at uh, New Media Marketing Pros How To.